Much. The winter storm is expected to bring even more snowfall to our mountains. Jason Slaw shows us the impact it's leaving in Julian. Snowy and windy conditions in Julian with Wednesday a sneak peek of what's to come. It was windy. I thought my house was going to blow off. But my neighbor's barn, the roof blew off into my yard. But so it was it was pretty hairy windy last night. For much of the day, any snowfall was off and on at times blowing sideways, but there was still enough of it to have some fun. Corey Pinkerton came up from Ramona with his boys. They're OK. They're really anxious to build a snowman and uh, have been playing in the snow and a little on the cold side. Some parents like Karen Marie Marino were out with their kids because area schools closed for the day. Our district is out of snow days already, so they ha they can't. We have to bring schoolwork home and like be in attendance or whatnot. So yeah. But you say they brought they brought home packets. Good yeah. Through. Their teachers sent them home with packets. I want to say through Monday or at least Friday. What do you plan to do on your non school days? Sleep. <laughs> Main Street was mostly quiet, though snow plows made regular trips to keep it clear. Residents are grateful for that, especially getting up into residential areas so neighbors can leave their homes if they need to. They don't always catch us because they have to do the highway, but they came up and they plowed. I'm on a little small road, real skinny, and they plowed. It's the only reason I was able to dr dr drive down and get my matcha tea. Kathy Scott and other locals say they are taking this storm seriously and planned ahead. Well, we all go shopping. And yeah, so everybody pretty much prepares for it. You know that we know that we're going to get snowed in, and and so you just prepare to have food and heat and wood. And as locals prepare to keep warm overnight, they're also anticipating bigger crowds to come up and enjoy the snow this week. In Julian, Jason Slots, Fox 5 News.